Hello to you once again, Martin Tyler here. Welcome to Goodison Park. And Everton. And today it's Everton, and they play Bournemouth. The Everton lineup today: number one, Jordan Pickford. Number twenty-three, Seamus Coleman. Number four. The Everton lineup for you. Lucas Digne starts with Seamus Coleman as the wide defenders. Bernard starts with Theo Walcott out wide. And they'll play it with a sole striker. Number 17, Idrissa Gaye. Number 8, Andre Gomez. Number 11, Theo Walcott. Number 20, Bernard. Bournemouth are going to go with this team today. One main striker, one probably just off it. How are they going to find attacking routes with this formation? Well, whether they can create through the middle, we'll wait and see. I just think today those two wide lads in midfield are going to be important. Both got a bit of pace, capable of getting around the outside. Everything is blue here at Goodison Park in a tribute to the famous blue shirts of Everton Football Club. Yeah, always been a good pitch, a good surface. I certainly enjoyed coming here. Enjoy the crowd appreciate good football too. Well, Goodison Park is still one of our favourite grounds to visit, Alan, isn't it? Because it shakes when <laughs> Everton do well. Possibly haven't made the ground shake enough in recent times. No, I don't think they have, but... Uh, those fans, when they get going, they do make a noise. And it's been a privilege to visit Goodison Park over the years. Lema and King. Josh King. Wilson. Trying to switch on the attacking power in this situation. Excellent challenge. Lema. Brooks. Josh King. A couple of options for him from the free kick, whether to go for goal or put it to where his teammates are lining up. Well, this is a really good opportunity to take the lead. That's a good strike in the end, and just wide. Yeah, he did hit it well. Not sure the keeper was getting there, you know. Oh, just too high, and uh, it was coming down too. Yeah, he's got some dip on it, but it just didn't come soon enough. Fraser. Sermon. Charlie Daniels. Brooks. Lema to Brooks. Short passes, but they're keeping the ball. Bit of space to go forward into with the ball. Well, he's got the ball there in the defensive zone by reading the play very well. Trying to get the ball in behind. There was a chance, really, of getting into a scoring position then, but anything but. Here's Wilson. Francis. Lema. Cook. Throw in here. Bernard. He spotted a teammate and he's got the technique as well as the vision to switch the play. Francis. Francis. Brooks. And it's gone out for a throw. 
As for Everton, it's a challenge for them in a match like this. They need to be at full throttle, I think, to uh, really do themselves justice against this team. Goalkeeper opts to punch. Well, all credit for taking the volley on, but in the end, nowhere near the target. Well, it's a difficult skill, and you get it off a fraction, and that can happen. It goes wide. Charlie Daniels saw the pass coming and got there first. He's got support here. Andre Gomez, he's got his shot off now. But what a good try, off the outside of the post. Certainly caught it, and I don't think the keeper was getting across to that. has given the ball away saw the goal and went for it out in front of goal and that's dealt with the problem good interception there sermon charlie daniels that's played back to begovic Lema to Brooks. Wasteful pass, unforced error, really. He's come into this area, into his own midfield to collect the ball. Rather deep position, but you can see what they're doing. They're keeping possession by doing it. Gilfie Sigurdsson. Whipped in from the wide area. Gone for the header, and we love to see that, especially you, Alan, but you could head it much, much better than this one. Well, you've got to be committed to those headers, and he wasn't quite... And King. Lema. Wilson. Brooks. Did well, stuck out a foot and cut off the pass. Now he's got the ball. What's he going to do with it? And the decision for the added time is three minutes. Here's Wilson. Just a mistake, really. He's not even asked too much of the opponent. It's just a mishit pass. Brooks. Josh King to Brooks. Francis. Uh, cut out by the defender. And there is the half-time whistle. Nil-nil at the break. Half-time. Uh, the teams are level. Where do we see a breakthrough coming for one of these sides? Well, it's difficult, really, to see after that first 45 minutes of evidence, but so often you do see it when, after the break, things open up a little bit, more chances either end. Well, we're going to get some thrills in the second half. We're going to get some spills, that's for sure, because it's still very wet out there. And there's no sign of the uh, weather taking a turn for the better. He's coming forward with some danger. Cut out the pass. Francis. Lema. Josh King. Now Andre Gomez. Coleman. Strong challenge. Cook. He's got it away. Wilson. Fraser. It could have got through there, but the defender was absolutely on top of his game. Sermon. Good screening. And he's kept the ball. Charlie Daniels. We've got the away manager indicating he wants to make a substitution now. Well, he clears the danger. 
I know, Alan, this is one of your favourite referees, and he's done well here, hasn't he? He's come back and done the booking, having let the play go on earlier. Yeah, exactly. You've got to give the advantage to the team in possession. He did that, but he also punished the offender. Theo Walcott. He's spotted a teammate, and he's got the technique, as well as the vision, to switch the play. And that will clear the danger. And the referee has given the free kick. Substitution. Well, it's going to be a substitution now. Number eight, Andreas Gomez. Coming onto the pitch, number 18, Morgan Stanley. Able to cut that out with um, some sharp movement. Gilfie Sigurdsson. Let's fly! Threw everything behind that shot and frustrated that it wasn't quite on target. Well, if he keeps getting in those kind of areas, I'm sure he'll score pretty soon. <laughs> Sermon. Charlie Daniels. Fraser. And 20 minutes to go. At the moment, the pitch is steered through. And in the shot, go! The keeper might be needed again, he didn't hang on to the ball. The crowd here still gasping. Shots on here. Well, he's reached that spectacularly. So I thought that was minute. in, Martin, I've got to say. The manager's going to bring on a fresh player now. To be replaced by number 23. Nathaniel Klein. Put the corner in the middle. It's come off the goalkeeper, still in play. Powerful drive, close enough to suggest. Have another go, son. Yeah, strong shot. I think the keeper saw it coming all the way, though. Morgan Schneiderle. Came in with a challenge. Couldn't go down the outside, he's gone inside. We've given it straight to the opposition. Shot on! You see what sort of system they use to defend the corner. in from the corner that is a startling save that's all about reactions and agility well this could be a key corner for Everton in the dying minutes go, go. in goes the corner can't put them in front here good defending but the pressure's still on and that's a corner it could be an important one let's see what Everton can do with it Corner's taken. And the header just over. So Always seemed to be on the stretch for that. Couldn't quite get above it. Number 24, Ryan Fraser. To be replaced by number 10, Jordan Arnold. There is still time for either side to win this with five minutes left. It's Jordan Ibe. Charlie Daniels. Gone behind for a goal kick. Man of the match, number 12, Lucas Dine. Here they come again. Another attack in the closing stage. He's got his shot off now. The time to be added on here is a minimum of three minutes. Idrissa Ghana Gay. Couldn't keep it, Everton. Nathaniel Klein. 
Oh, that's a wonderful ball. Can they going to try his luck? Well, it's a corner now, and that means a chance late on. In goes the corner. It is a corner that's too close. And the referee has brought the regulation time to a close with the team still level.